painting this. Welcome back, guys, to another episode of Hookers TV. Today, we're going to be preparing the Poon Slayer to be painted. Right now, I'm just getting it sanded. You can see I was testing the primer we had. I'm going to sand the whole thing all the way inside and out. I'm going to go over the caulking. I'm going to do everything. I'm going to tape these off in the old stickers on the other side because I think they look kind of cool. So we're going to keep all those on. Uh, just going to sand the whole thing. Very, very, very important things is one, you want to cover everything you don't want to get paint on. So for example, that's the boat. That's the tractor. I got a motor under that tarp. You do not want to get overspray from the primer or the paint on there. And two, you want to make sure it's a well ventilated area. So I got the garage door open about maybe a foot, the door, windows open, stuff like that. So, all right, we're good to go now. primer now with aluminum I'm using self etching primer what it does it has an acid in it and it eats away at the aluminum and it, it lets the primer stick to it and it lets the paint adhere to it as well mistake I forgot to uh, tape off the tag on the boat the registration tag so I had to wipe all the primer off and I'm gonna do it now don't forget to do that Now that everything's primed, we're just gonna get back and uh, 
We're gonna lightly sand the primer with some 220 grit that Frank's cutting out right now. We're gonna wipe it down with paint thinner once again and then get the painting. Uh, it says it has to be painted 50 degree, let it dry for 24 hours in 70 degree heat. So you just wanna make sure you do everything right. We got a gray color for the outside, so here goes nothing. wet sanding this paint I have a 400 grit sandpaper and I just spray a little bit of water on it and I'm just gonna wet sand it lightly and then wipe it down with uh, with some paint thinner just to get the dust off and I'm gonna put start putting the second coat on As you can see now, I already have the inside of the boat primed. Um, now, I just gotta paint it with the rust oleum paint. I did the front a little bit here. Um, I'm gonna put the first coat on. Looks pretty good so far. All right, guys, uh, right now what we're doing is just painting the inside. Um, we're fixing it up. So, we painted almost the entire inside, uh, extended it into where the carpet's gonna be and overlapped it a little bit in case the carpet peels up for us a little bit. Um, and then we just took these brushes and went all along the inside of this seam here. And right now we're just doing little small touch-up stuff. But here's the inside of the boat painted. Check it out. Now the whole inside is painted and we got all the details touched up. We even fixed the stickers on the outside, chased with a steady hand. Did them real nice. It looks, I mean, honestly, it looks great. I couldn't be happier, honestly. You want to make sure it's, I almost spelled that. You want to make sure it's drying at 70 degrees. That's what it says on the can. And me shooting it. The front's 67. Back's 80. I gotta kick the heater up a little bit, but you just want to make sure you got it dry and read the directions. Make sure you do it in the right temperature and everything.
right, guys. Thanks for watching another episode of Hookers TV, and we'll catch you next time when we start carpeting it.